I just wanted to do a mini craft haul today. I just got back from Hobby Lobby and I wanted to show you guys a few of the items that I purchased. There are items that I've been wanting to get or I just needed more of and I just wanted to share them with you, um, you know, just in case you get any ideas or if you also want to try them out. So the first thing that I got, it's this artist acrylic inspired paint. Um, it is permanent, water resistant, and flexible when dry. It also thins with water. It can clean with soap and water while wet. Um, so this one is in number 31515, Peaches and Cream. And I got this color because it's really cute. It's the same color that I use on all the cheeks on my charms. So it worked out perfectly and it's actually a pretty large container. Um, I feel like I'm going to be using this for a long time for a long time and it was originally $6.99 and it was on clearance and I just want to show you the color real quick because I think it's just so cute for cheek colors um, so let me just show you real quick okay here is the color and as you guys can see it looks kind of pink in the camera but it's actually pretty peachy and it's really really thick as you can see I mean it's almost tipping over and it's not even coming out um, but I like it because you can thin it out with water and it'll go a very long way. So The next thing I bought was the Sculpey Glass Glaze and I've used this before. I'm not a big fan of it but I do like the way it stays so I just picked up another one. The last time that I bought one it was just, I don't know, it, it was clumpy and weird and it just didn't come out. So this one I made sure that it was very, very liquidy as you can see. And... Um, I really do like this one. I just, I think because of the last one that I bought, it just really like ruined my <laughs> my liking for this. But I'm hoping that I'll regain, um, you know, me liking this after I use it again. Um, if you guys haven't checked this one out, it's really, you know, it's it leaves it, um, I'm not going to say too glossy. It kind of leaves it like plasticky also. I think um, this is just my opinion also, so... Um, you know, if you guys want to try it out and let me know what you guys think, just comment down below. The next thing I bought was some head pins. I have been using eye pins, um, for quite some time now, I guess. Now, I got the 2 inch, um, 165 pieces and these are $4.99. The next thing that I bought is these seashells. And it has colored seashells, regular seashells. I just thought they were just so super, super cute. Um, I'm actually going to do a charm um, with one of these. I'm not going to tell you guys what it is because I want it to be a surprise. Um, but if you guys have made anything with shells, just comment down below or just post a video response. Because um, I would love to see what you guys have made with shells. Um, I've, I've never actually done anything with shells. I got were these two little containers and um, I got these containers because I like to save my head pins and stuff in containers. Um, let me show you. These are my head pins right now and um, I just save them in containers like this. And as you can see, this one, it doesn't really close though. The head pins are too long. So I wanted something a little bit longer. So I went in and hit up and I bought these, which works out perfectly because, um, you know, these head pins will, will work perfectly. And sorry, I was calling these head pins, but they're the eye pins. These are the eye pins. So I got these to save my head pins and my eye pins. These ones are actually only 99 cents, so, I mean, what the heck. <laughs> I will take it if they are cheapo. And last... Or not last, actually. The next thing I bought is this. You guys haven't seen my craft area, but I do store my clay in um, bins like this. So I got another one because I did get more clay and I ran out of room on my other one. And I like these because it has the um, dividers and I could just divide it. Um, I can make the compartments as big or as little as I want. So I picked up another one of these and this one, I believe, was $7.99. And like I said, all of my items were purchased from Hobby Lobby. Two things that I bought today were these cute little stickers. And they just look like this. This is the alphabet one. 
so I thought this one was really really cute and then I got these cute 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 ones and actually this inspired me um I've done a lot of these things already out of polymer clay but these ones just look so cute so I just wanted to to get these and they're just so cute so I hope that you guys enjoyed this mini haul. It was very, very small. I did go to Hobby Lobby just actually last week, I believe, and I did get more stuff, but it's really not anything. Um, it's just, I just got like more eye pins, um, lanyards, and cell phone straps. So it, it wasn't too big of a, of a haul to make a video for. But let me know about your ideas. Let me know um, what you guys think of this China Glaze the Sculpey if you guys haven't already or if you guys have already used it and also post a picture or just comment down below what you've made or a video response of what you've made um, with seashells before. I would love to hear your ideas and I hope you guys enjoyed watching this and I will talk to you guys later. Bye!